Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, just a short video, a small tutorial to help you guys out with a issue I just recently had creating a USB thumb drive uh, for the new Windows 10. So basically you'll need a eight gigabyte or larger thumb drive and a Windows 10 ISO. So basically for the first step, to make things simple, drop your ISO in the root directory. So you'll probably have to authenticate. Um, so basically just make sure it's in the root directory. This will save you a bunch of hassle a little bit later. It will make sense. So first of all, open your terminal and basically run these commands. Uh, they're all case sensitive and in this order. So first of all type disk util space list Now if you look in the list uh, You should notice That your USB drive is not connected So you should insert your USB drive And once it appears Run another disk util space list and you should notice that the uh, disk 2 will appear so now that we know it's disk two, what we want to do is run disk util space unmount disk space slash dev slash disk two. And you'll notice the USB thumb drive will disappear from your desktop. Okay, next. So, we are going to type sudo space dd space if equals slash and if your ISO starts with a capital W like mine, type in a capital W and press tab. It will auto-complete because the ISO is in the root directory. Now type space, as in press the space bar, then of equals dev slash disk two slash, sorry, disk two space vs equals one. Now once you hit enter, it will ask you for your password. Now let that run through. Now in this situation, I've typed disk util space list just to double check that the USB drive is there. And now type disk util space eject space slash dev slash disk two. Now, remove your USB thumb drive from your Mac, wait a second, and plug it back in. Once the drive is mounted, you can open it, double check there are a bunch of Windows system files, and there you go, bootable Windows 10 USB. Thanks.